Gamer Gazette here. Since Tucker Carlson interviewed Putin in Russia, everyone wants to talk to him now. Putin made a bold statement in an interview recently, expressing his preference for Joe Biden over Donald Trump as the U.S. president. Let's take a look at a clip of the interview. Biden. Biden. He is the more experienced person. He is predictable. He is a politician of the old formation. But we will work with any U.S. leader who the American people have confidence in. Pretty slick move, Putin. Now, you might be wondering what's really going on. I'll explain. According to Putin, Biden comes across as more predictable and experienced. To put the situation in simpler terms, Trump scares the shit out of Russia. Trump, ever the fighter, didn't take this lying down. In fact, he responded by calling Putin's words a compliment. Classic Trump, isn't it? Further adding to the propaganda, Putin dismissed claims about Biden's mental fitness for office, adding another layer to this political race, he wants to be in it. Now, let's shift our focus to Trump. He had previously made a statement suggesting he would allow Russia to do as it pleases with NATO member nations that don't meet defense spending requirements. That's quite a bold move. But what about Biden? Well, he pledged to defend all NATO territory, a stark contrast to Trump's stance. This, combined with Putin's comments, has undoubtedly added fuel to the fire of this political rematch. Putin's preference for Biden over Trump due to predictability is definitely an underhanded slight at Biden. Trump's unconventional approach towards Russia and NATO keeps them all off balance. While Biden's pledge to defend all NATO territory is exactly the predictability Putin can use as leverage. The takeaway here is that Putin is using a reverse strategy to interfere in American politics as usual. He doesn't really care who wins, and his opinion doesn't matter. Keep your eyes open and vote your heart, Americans. Share your thoughts in the comment section below. It helps this channel grow.